YouTube, what's up? It's your boy Crypto J coming at you guys with yet another J Talks Crypto. If you're new to my channel, hit the subscribe button as well as bell notification. I do my best each and every day to give you guys the topics in cryptocurrency. Guys, nothing has changed. Nothing has changed. Today, I wanted to give you guys a little update on um, Chill Guy because Chill Guy is looking like it is in a possible bottom, hopefully, on this project. I mean, as you guys could see, um, it has created this pattern in the past, right? And it has shot up from a similar type of pattern, right? Created this up pattern right here. It even shoots up right here. Creates this pattern. Double bottom. Pumps. Same thing. Up right here. Double bottom, maybe. Maybe we could see some upside, but again, we got to close some of these, these longer candles. And again, guys, I'm not telling you to go out and buy this. As a matter of fact... Not a financial advisor, guys. I would go, I would actually tell you don't buy this. Um, don't buy anything that I talk about on the channel, guys. I, I just literally am just talking about these coins, speculating on them, um, but they're highly volatile, and I'm not a professional. So do not go buy things based off of things that you heard on the channel. You have to do your own research, um, you know, but... Uh, this is a coin that has been kind of trending, as you guys can see. Hmm, not looking too hot on the one-hour chart. Looking like maybe we might be trending down. Let's pull up some of these more um, bigger indicators. And again, guys, if you guys like the content, you can always, again, hit the subscribe button, the bell notification. Look, these Keltner channels, we've already rejected now off of this level right here. Um, we definitely broke down off of some momentum. This could be... This could really go either way. You know, the one hour chart is looking a little bit funky, definitely, for sure. Um, let's see some of these more smaller intervals. Let's see what's going on in 30 minute, right? See if we're still holding any uh any good any good traction over on the 30 minute. If the computer will actually let me do that. Let me refresh. What the hold on. All right. 30 second. There we go. Oh Lord. And look, we we lost the Ketner channel. Look at that. See that? Got the MIG Wi-Fi, ghetto internet. No, I'm just kidding. But um, yeah, look at this, dude. Not not necessarily the best thing you want to see. We might see a retest of this lower level of this Ketner channel, um, based off of this 30 minute chart. Um, but again, it's definitely been some big sell action just happened within the last uh the last 15 minute candle. Actually, look, we had a rising wedge form in here, and maybe this broke down. Within again, just the past 30 minutes. Interesting. Again, our five minute chart showing that now we've rejected off of this upper or this lower level of the Ketner channel, creating this nasty little spill off. This is what I call a slippery slope sometimes, guys. When the price is looking like this, it could be a slippery slope when we keep uh, breaking underneath this Ketner channel. Look at that. It's going to might print another red. Yikes. You see, we want to start seeing some turnaround. I want to see this thing. It really significantly needs to start turning around, I feel like, after this um, sell-off. Because, look, we got a shoulder head shoulder here, and that could be mighty dangerous, right? This could also be a bear flag playing out, too, on this more micro chart. So, I mean, in my opinion, this thing might not pick up in volume if it's going to pick up more in volume anytime soon until it reaches more of, like, an up-here level. And again, you're going to get people FOMOing in think that maybe... You know, it's found some kind of footing or something like that. But again, look, we're rejecting off of that range. And that's what I want to be paying attention to if I'm in this trade. And again, guys, it's not financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy it. This thing can go up very quick. It can go down very quick. That's cryptocurrency. It could be zero tomorrow. So again, that's why that's why I recommend actually you, that you don't buy it and that you don't listen to anything. And any YouTuber says about cryptocurrency, guys, just do your own research every time, guys. Just go and do your own research. But again, uh, this thing is looking like it might be going down again. Look, shoulder hit shoulder. Yikes. I don't know. Another retest of this range. Let's see it. Let's watch it play out, guys. I I like to I like to watch it with you guys. How about that? We'll watch it. We'll give it a couple seconds. We're on the we're on the one minute chart right now, so we'll see how this how this plays out is a great time to, you know, get you a hot pocket or, you know, do whatever you got to do. Let the dog out. We don't. Oh, no. Look at that. See, look, we might see some spill off. We print another red. We might break this, this little lower level here. This thing's sitting at some, uh, it's actually sitting at some key support. So it's actually good that we're watching this. And again, this is a project that I like. 
not I'm not trying to throw no shade on this project or anything like that. Um, we're just doing this again. This is just for educational purposes, guys. I already told you don't buy it. Just looking at this chart um, just to see if we're going to close above this Kettner channel or if we're just going to keep closing all these little mini candles down low. I mean, it's trying to find some kind of footing, right? And maybe it could be starting to round out. Look at our five minute chart is so far below. Yikes, this thing, like I said, it's looking like a slippery slope. And sometimes that's what happens when your coin has a parabolic run up. Um, again, this could be an indicator that we might need to see some lower levels. We might need to even retest some of these lower levels right here. Um, and this thing might, you know, create a wedge. I don't know. I don't know what's going to happen. They could eat up this candle pretty quick too. Um, it's just really going to, oh, look at that. Maybe, maybe. Maybe this thing makes a comeback, guys. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I definitely want to know what you guys think about this coin. Uh, also, guys, if you like coins like this, if you like being early in coins like this, guys, we caught we caught this coin around 100,000 market cap in, in the Telegram, guys. Why weren't you plugged in there? I don't know why you weren't plugged in there. You should have been plugged in there, guys. You should have plugged in, guys, because we were talking about the fact that this thing kept trending. It kept trending. It kept trending. And then it listed. It was amazing. It was an amazing thing. But the only way that you could have found out about that, guys, is if you're plugged into my Patreon. So tap into my Patreon. But also for you guys um, that don't want to spend $10, um, I got a free resource for you guys too, right? Your homie looking out. You see I am? See I am? Got a free resource for you guys. All you got to do is share this video over on Twitter at JTalksCrypto. And I'll invite you to the free Telegram. There's a ton of free resource in there. Uh, you can connect with people. It's a fun place to talk to people. It's not a place for financial advice, guys. So don't go in there with your pocketbooks out. But you may be able to get some questions answered um, that you might have in crypto. And you may be able to talk to your homie, Crypto J. So again, guys, I will catch you guys in the next video. I appreciate you. I love you. And again, yeah, if nobody loves you guys, Crypto J loves you. That's right. Catch you next one. Peace.